Brendan Howe here with your TDC Net Tech Tip, giving you tips and tricks on how to use technology more effectively. Today I'm talking about Office 365. It's the second in our five part video tech tip series on Office 365. Today I'm talking about 10 different benefits and why a lot of businesses are moving to Office 365. If you haven't seen my first video tech tip, go to our website, tdcnet.ca. It gives a brief introduction into what Office 365 is. Uh, and today I'm gonna to be talking about why you might wanna use Office 365. So I'm gonna go through these benefits fairly quickly. There are 10 of them, so there's a lot of content I wanna get through. So number one, the first benefit of Office 365, you reduce your risk of the IT environment. When you separate, a lot of businesses now have their email hosted on site at their office. When you separate that out and you put it into the cloud, it eliminates the risk of your email going down, your whole business going down, because say you have a power outage uh, or there's an issue in your building or you have something like the, uh, the Toronto flood from a few weeks ago that happens. Number two, shift the burden on to Microsoft. You know what, a lot of businesses are used to having servers running Microsoft Exchange locally hosted. Uh, you can get rid of those servers, you can get rid of the licensing issues, the constant upgrade fees, the project fees, the hassle, that sort of thing. You can offload it off, of, off onto Microsoft. Number three, no VPN required. So there's a lot of people that uh, are used to Connecting into VPN so that you can get at your email and connect into um, your, your work email calendar contacts, that sort of thing. Uh, with Office 365, you can connect into all that sort of stuff, but you don't need VPN. You can just connect from anywhere. It's kind of nice. Number four, uh, it amazes me that there's still a bunch of businesses that, uh, that don't have mobile devices, whether they're smartphones or tablets, properly synced up so that their email calendar contacts all work flawlessly together. Well, with Office 365, it does that. And they, they work together. If you delete an email in one place, it'll delete it elsewhere. If you update a calendar item, a contact, that sort of thing, it's really quick. It'll update it on all your different mobile devices. And we all have smartphones, tablets, computers, all these different devices these days. And when they're not kind of working together in the same, it's a big pain in the butt. Okay, number five, new security policies. So mobile devices have massive amounts of data on them. Office 365 gives, gives you the opportunity to force passwords to remotely wipe devices and a bunch of other things uh, related to security for those mobile devices. Uh, number six, Microsoft Office. You can put Microsoft Office on mobile devices. This just came out. So if you've got an, um, an Apple iPhone or iPad or a Windows phone, you can actually install Microsoft Office on those phones so that you can do the same sort of stuff that you can do on your PC. Number seven, there's some big, big opportunities for your business. Uh, software, SharePoint, Link, SkyDrive, these are pieces of software that aren't being used by a lot of businesses. I'm going to go through them in subsequent tech tips to give people uh, an idea of how they can be used and what opportunities there are for your business. Uh, number eight, uh, it's great to have a per, uh, per user scalable monthly cost. So there's no upfront fees with, uh, with Office 365. As your business grows, you just increase the number of users. If your business decreases in size, you decrease the number of users along with that. The only caveat to that is your first year, you have to make a commitment uh, for the full year for the number of users. But then after that, it's a, it's a recurring monthly cost. Number nine, second last benefit, you know all those uh, senior executives and uh, people that have massive mailboxes uh, that, that they don't want to delete any email, they have every email from the beginning of time. Well, Office 365 enables these people by giving a, a 25 gig mailbox, uh, which is a massive mailbox so that they don't have to clean up their mailbox and they can just have, uh, have every email they've ever received in there. Uh, and number 10, last but not least, you get rid of the Microsoft Office licensing mess. We have tons of clients that have some computers with Office 2007, some with 2010, some with 2013. It's like you're in this constant upgrade cycle. You can never get everybody on the same version of Microsoft Office at the same time. Well, your subscription to Microsoft Office 365 includes all your office licensing so you can deploy it across your entire company and you can have everybody running on the same version of office at the same time so there you go this is part two in our office 365 101 series 
Uh, next week, I'm going to be going into a little bit more detail of some of the different software uh, that's included in, in Office 365 and the benefits of things like SharePoint, Link, SkyDrive, and it, I'm going to progress into our Office 365 201 series. So if you found this uh, tech tip useful, please share it on Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, Google+. If you found it useful, there's probably some, uh, some other people out there that might find it useful as well. For now, this has been your TDC Net Tech Tip. I'm Brendan Howe giving you tips and tricks on how to use technology more effectively. Have yourself a great day.